mm. we've been Facebook friends for a while now, and mm. I don't see you really pushing your products. Now, I do see no. you really ranting about the whole Facebook banning of body painters. Oh, yeah. Oh. Because, because they, they hurt my team, they hurt my artists, I've hurt friends, I consider most of them friends. They're not Facebook friends, they're personal friends of mine. If no. I see Matteo Affinotti, who's the first two-time world champion. Oh, yeah. And I talked to him, and he was so baffled about the fact that he was banned over nothing. And I see other people from my team, and people who are not in my team, but are... And for instance, using all different products, but are such great artists. And I see how shocked they are. Really, personally, shocked and hurt. And it's the, uh, and, uh, and uh, how do you say it, when it, somebody is anom anonymous. Mm -hmm. and <laughs> that fact, that people can report it anonymous, and you get a message that it violates the nudity and porn I see models who, who react. We are so careful how we treat our models. We shield them, we guide them, we, we guard them. We, mm -hmm. we, we, I hope that 100% of the painters treat their models well. Most of the models I know are such decent, nice people who are devoted and helpful and they don't earn an, a penny. Most of them pay for their own stuff. Yeah. Their own stays, and then to 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 have a stamp on your head being a porn and nudity model, I, I, it, it's it's it, it's it's a it's a horrible thing. I mean, it's as as both an artist and 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 I I I know that for me, just indirectly, when I had my stuff banned, I was furious. Oh, I was furious, and I. In my particular case, I was, I'm kind of aware of who was the person that was banning. So, who was actually reporting it. Um, because I had an argument with someone that day. So for me, it was, it was pretty obvious who it was. Because it just happens to be that, that <coughs> same day that I get in a big argument with someone, all of a sudden all my stuff gets removed. It's a little, a little suspicious there. A few months ago, it was a sort of... I mean this sarcastically. I hope mm. that you understand. Yes. Elite group I called the Nipplegate group. Mm -hmm. But the last few weeks, it turned into a, a massive storm of banning, deleting, and, and blocking. Whole pages missing right. from two of the most, most respected festivals and and... And some artists that that are in the top twenty of, of the world. Yeah. Pages, complete pages banned. And it used to be, as you say, you had a hunch on who it was. And you could say, Well pff, whatever. Alex always says, Whatever. Mm -hmm. But now it's a whole storm. It's it's not even a storm, it's an, it's, it's a hurricane. Yeah. And you don't know who does it. And I get people coming to me saying, oh, is, is, does it have anything to do with Chameleon? Because most of the artists belong to your team. I don't know. You know, it, here's, here's the thing. is that If you notice, I put up that post saying that if anybody would like to um, contribute information, because um, my wife is putting a, together a paper on... Mm -hmm. Uh, about this, um, and basically about cyberbullying, um, and we don't know if it's going to be helpful or not, but it is gathering of information, and we've been looking, I've been looking at the images that have been banned, and there's a few of them that, okay, yes, there's nudity, and it, it is a direct, it, it is a direct violation of what their statement is about nudity. Whether or not it qualifies under art, and that sort of, that's a whole separate conversation. Uh, at that point, the person is obviously nude. It's, you can tell 
at first glance, okay, they're nude, <laughs> and I can understand why someone may click on it not understanding that it's art, okay? Mm -hmm. Now, I will state that all the images that I saw were absolutely gorgeous and clearly, in my mind, on the side of art and nowhere near near porn because it, none of it was um, suggestive. Yeah. It was all... Um, or they were the models weren't being objectified. It was about the pure beauty. So I'm yeah. very clear about that. Or, or look at special effects. This morning I had a notice again that uh, body paints were Yvonne Sonnenberg, um, uh, who did, who won first prize at Physoc, Species Three. That's not nude. That is science fiction. Yeah. And you can obviously see that it is. A body paint based on a costume on a film in Species 3. There's nothing nude, there's nothing porn. But if you report a, a, a photo, a whole bunch of photos from a, a page called uh, Nude Aunties, no, Nude Busty Aunts, mm. like Uncle and Aunts, yeah. and they say, this, this, these photos don't. Uh, uh, um, are, well, they comply to every rule, and and we don't see a point in deleting this. Downright porn. Yeah. I report downright porn. Freddie Schmidt in Austria reported real porn, and was it was not violation, not against violations. And why so, is PC three news? I you know, and that's that's the whole thing that that really offends me is that. There was um, <coughs> there was one particular painting that I did, which was uh, Benton, so the Japanese goddess of art, um, yeah. and that one the model was actually wearing a bathing suit. So, if you were to see her walking down the beach, that would have been fine. Yeah. The moment I slap paint on her, it becomes porn. What the hell? And it's um, dirty. Exactly. You're dirty. I, and it's it's whoever whoever looked at it didn't look at it close enough to see the bathing suit, and it's it's just it, it's really frustrating. And like you said before, I I'm I'm very thankful that the model didn't realize that that got that got banned because I wouldn't want her to it, to have that happen because I'm offended. Just because I painted it, because that's a part of me that I put there. Now, just think how the models must feel when it's actually them. But my models, and I say my, not because they're mine, yeah. but because I have so so much lovely models to be grateful for, especially here in the Netherlands and you know in Europe. I name Kim Kim on Arts. Sasha van der Wecke, uh, Julie Bone, uh, Abby, uh, uh, Belinda, and Wendy. Um, and in Germany, uh, I have them to be thankful for because they they supported me from the start. They helped me, and they are active on on Facebook. They they support um, their artists. They put in so much effort. Not just because they like to be a model, and they do they don't do it for the fame and glory, because they all have jobs, they all have they all have um, either uh, degrees, good jobs, great backgrounds, you name it. We didn't drag them from from a, a drugs uh, a hole yeah. and say, hey, let's get you baby baby. No way, those are educated, nice, decent. Sociable girls and men. Let's not forget the men. You can't forget the men. But the men aren't banned. A man nipple is allowed. A woman's boob, even covered with a nipple cover, is not allowed. Those girls are active, and I'm so grateful for them because they've been supportive in this whole thing. And they are having this stamp on their face. Wow, we're poor models. Bam. And I, this morning somebody said to me, I don't, I don't see why you get so fussed up and, and why you're so angry and take it easy, it will blow away. But I think if, if you, can, you can 
There you had, like, like an ostrich, uh, mm. that's the animal, isn't it? Yes, ostrich. In the sand and pretend nothing's wrong, but then nobody will do anything. And I know we have a saying in the Netherlands, if you, you stick your head out, uh, above the corn, it will likely be chopped off. I know I take that risk, but if I don't do it together with some other people, nobody will. And it will go on and on and on and on. And I, this is not correct. Yeah, it's 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 definitely wrong. It it needs to. Yes. And and the thing is, is that Facebook really needs to to take a look at their policy. They they have no appeal process. You can't say, hey, wait a second, she's wearing a bathing suit. There's no way to say that. I mean, no. even and and that's the thing that really gets me is that okay, <laughs> yes, I have a couple paintings that I know that if I put them up, they're going to get banned because it's very obvious. That she's nude. Okay, I can accept that. I, I'm, I'm more than willing to accept that. And there's other venues where that might be more appropriate. That I that's okay. That gets into that whole conversation whether or not this is the right venue for this type of painting. That's fine. It's the ones like Benton where she's wearing a bathing suit, and in that the, she's perfectly legal to walk anywhere. And even walk into a public library dressed exactly as she was. But if I were to cover up and, and paint, and, and but, but, you know, worries me very much. Facebook, you cannot have an account at Facebook if you're under sixteen. First of all, mm -hmm. a lot of kids are there with a fake name, with allowing, with with with, with uh, uh, approval of their parents. Yes, hardly any parents controls what their kid are doing. My boy has his Facebook page and every now and then I check on his wall what is going on. And when both my pages were blocked, he was sitting beside me and allowed me to use his messages uh, um, part of Facebook so mm -hmm. I could contact some people and say, hey, listen, I'm writing you for my boy's Facebook just to let you know I'm banned or blocked, mm -hmm. blocked for a week. But hardly any body controls that people are underage. Why are we treated like dumb children to delete a photo that is over 18 or over 16 because your account doesn't allow you to be under age 16? Mm -hmm. You don't know who reported you. They don't give you any information, any information whatsoever. What is wrong with the photo? The only claim is pornography or nudity. And why is there such a difference between nude and nude? Yeah. If if I if I look at porn, it's being allowed. If I look at my art uh, photos, they're not allowed. Who makes the decisions? If I read that article that was uh, from that pissed off ex employee. Mm -hmm. who claimed that uh, they were uh, working for a dollar an hour in India, I think. Mm. I think that is, that is also a sign on the wall, because in India and in, 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 in Asia, they have different standards than we have. For us, a naked foot is a naked foot, and in, in Asia, it's an insult, an insult. So who is to judge what is acceptable or not? Yeah. Where, what what culture lies behind allowing and accepting? Is there a general accepting, or is there is this culture based, where you have an uh, uh, an out an outsourcement right. of your of your products, like Facebook does obviously, to to cheap labor in different countries? They have to know that they also will look at those photos with their own cultural backgrounds. Most of the porn I found came from India, Pakistan, Malaysia, and I thought, no wonder why my photos are being banned and blocked, and there's not, there are allowed. Because if they are also the ones who control that, and they see that those photos come from the same country, perhaps it's bias of me. Mm -hmm. Not objective, but I think that, that they are handling right now a... Uh, 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 um, oh, sometimes English isn't that the easiest people say it is. <laughs> but the, 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 to make these 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 um, uh, um, uh, decisions, 
decisions, there decisions. Goes. It should be based on Western uh, uh, culture. Well, um, and maybe maybe there needs to more, be. Well, I'm sorry. Well, I was reading the. Uh, it needs to be more defined. So, if they were to go and say. <laughs> We're not going to allow any nudity of any shape or form. It doesn't matter if it is art or not. Okay, yeah, and but that's exactly what I mean. Then at that point, then that's acceptable. I can accept that because at that point I realize, okay, if I post something that's that's nude in any shape or form, regardless if it's if it's artistic content, it's going to get banned. That I could understand. However, they say, but they do allow, like. Um, what was it? The um, uh, statue of David. I think that, was it that. Yeah, I think it was that they they do allow some artistic expressions, and it's like, um, really. A nude of Rembrandt was was deleted. Wow. Yeah. Wow. That. I mean, but but. And it's not that I'm not trying to be a racist or something, for yeah. heaven forbid, because I don't mean it as a racist thing. Mm -hmm. I really mean it's a. Di I think that by letting people judge from different cultures and not just where you outsource for cheapness, mm -hmm. you have a whole variety of people who can can make that judgment. If a photo is reported for nudity and it comes in a in a in a sorting uh, vicinity in India. Let somebody double check this from from another country, yeah, especially someone... when it concerns nudity and porn, because their standards in one country is not the same as in another country. Right. And you cannot allow one nudity and the other not. Yeah, it, it needs. Like to... you say, why is David allowed, and why isn't the the, the painting from Julie Bohm that is made in Austria last uh, uh, last World Body Paint Championship is not allowed? She was covered from head to toe. Nobody could see a thing. It was not allowed. It, it, it doesn't make sense. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. There needs to be a there needs to be an appeal process at least. Someone that you can say, "Hey, look, um, can you see a bathing suit?" Oh, yes, I can. Or I don't see a nipple here. I don't see there's a problem. This is this person is uh, you know, or or better yet, that, oh yeah, you can see it, but you have to look really, really close. And anybody who can see it by looking that close, well, obviously they're looking for it. <laughs> they're looking for it. Yes. And if, if they're looking that close, then really, who has the dirty mind? That's exactly what I'm on. That's exactly what I think, too. Sing it. 